What I'd like to do now is talk to you about the physical attributes of the Phonak Marvel range, starting with colour. Now there's no surprises here what Phonak has tried to achieve with their colour palettes that are available in the Marvel range, and that is discreteness. The hearing aids that are available in the colour palette basically attributed to hair and skin tones. So people who are concerned about how discreet the hearing aid is might choose to go with a colour that matches their hair or skin tone. The second key area that a lot of people are concerned about when they're selecting a hearing aid is the size. And what you have to make a decision on here is whether or not you'd go with a smaller device with less attributes. What I mean by this is, here in the dark grey we have the Phonak replaceable battery in the 312 size. This hearing aid is the MRT with a rechargeable lithium ion battery and a telecall which is a connectivity option in public places. As you can see here, there is a bit of a difference between the sizes of the two hearing aids. If you decide to go with a smaller option, you're effectively doing away with the lithium ion rechargeable battery and the telecoil. We also have an update to the button on the back of the hearing aid. Now this update on the button is more like a rocker button in the sense that it gives you the ability to adjust volume preset programs for certain difficult to hear environments that you'll work on with your clinician, as well as the ability to accept and reject calls when your phone is ringing in your pocket. Another key area of the Marvel range that's been updated is the receiver wire. Now this is the physical receiver wire that goes from the back of the hearing aid into your ear canal. Phonak has updated the way that the wire is preset and contours to the face with a number of different links. What this means is that you're going to have a receiver wire that contours to the face closer, it's more discreet and arguably more comfortable. Another area that's updated is the silicon dome on the end of the receiver wire and the wax filter. The dome on the end has been updated to a variety of sizes with open and vented options. The reason for this is to give you some options that have got a bit more of a natural sound as well as some that are a bit more comfortable. The other area that I'd like to clarify, which is one of the biggest questions that we get when people are calling over the phone, is how is the Marvel going to respond with someone who wears glasses? And the answer is we've had a lot of clients that have come into our clinic with different types of glasses with different frame thicknesses. And the reality is that we haven't had any complaints yet or any feedback that it's actually interfering with the hearing aid's performance.